of a minute. Hooray! Pause is dreaming. Dreaming about rabbits. He used to chase them. Now he only dreams about them. This is a story about loss and the comfort and joy to be found in cherished moments. Pause and Edward. Pause is dreaming, dreaming about rabbits. He used to chase them. Now he only dreams about them. Pause is glad that Edward is reading. That means he doesn't have to go out. They go out twice a day. That's more than enough for pause. You okay, pause? Should we go outside? Pause wags his tail. Not too hard. Just enough for Edward to notice. Pause is dreaming again about chasing rabbits and cats and cars and planes, but mostly rabbits. Wake up, Pause. Let's go for a walk. Edward is ready. Pause doesn't need to go out, but he follows along anyway. Edward could use some fresh air, thinks Pause. It's chilly outside. Pause knows where they headed. His pace is nice and easy. Pause doesn't feel the urge to run anymore. He has run enough. Sometimes on their walks, Edward meets someone he knows. Pause likes that. It means he gets to rest. Come on now, Pause. You can't stay here. We have to keep going. Pause completely forgot they were on a walk. The park is empty. No smells. No noises. No rabbits. Edward throws a stick. The stick disappears into the trees. Edward searches. Pause waits. Where are all the rabbits? Thinks Pause. And the birds. And the other dogs. Edward has found the stick. Are you tired, Pause? It feels good to lie in the grass together with Edward. Pause has walked and walked. His paws are heavy. Pause doesn't have to walk anymore. Pause doesn't have to do anything anymore. Edward's bed is warm and cozy, like rabbit fur. Pause sleeps and sleeps, sleeps and dreams. Edward calls for pause. Pause pretends not to hear. He isn't thirsty. He isn't hungry. He doesn't want to go out. All Pause wants to do is lie in Edward's bed and dream. Pause can feel Edward's heart beating. Edward is being so strange. His eyes are wet. Pause licks his hand. Edward needed that. And then Pause falls asleep. Asleep without dreams. Pause's spot is empty. His dish is in the cupboard. Empty. The house is quiet. Too quiet. Edward can't read. He goes outside for a walk without pause. Everything is there. The smells, the noises, even the rabbits. But not pause. Edward is dreaming. Dreaming about paws. Paws is happy. He barks and wags his tail. Finds sticks. Chases rabbits. Just like before. The End